episode two of the modding tutorial. Today we will be doing we will be doing tabs like well not tabs but like these menus here where when you're in creative you can go and grab items from that like that. Oh, I don't want advancements. I don't want advancements. Wow. And here we're going to be doing one called a tutorial mods and we'll put stuff in here later because that'll go with all the items and blocks and all that stuff when you guys make will go right in here. Right here. And I think oh. Yeah. Yeah, there's no scully. Oh, there this is the scully thing for it. Yeah. Alright. And that's what we'll be doing today. So let me quit the game and whoa. <coughs> actually explain how we're gonna do it. <coughs> Which which, uh, so what we're going to do is, uh, I can't think, but whatever. What we're going to do is a public, I can't spell public, public static final uh, item group, call it whatever you want to call it, I'm just going to call it tab, and equal a new item group, is what we'll say. Uh, ignore the errors for now, well, other than... Adding a semicolon at the end of that. And put ever, <clears throat> like, the label for it. It's not going to be the exact label. We're going to go and change that later in the code. Label, we'll just call it tutorial. I can't spell tutorial today. I can't spell tutorial. There we go. And what it says, make icon, that's going to be the icon that appears. Like, as we saw, there was redstone in the other as we saw there was redstone in the other so that is what we're going to do so for this it requires an item stack which the items aren't made in items they are made the, uh, the, the items aren't made the items are made as items as as item as item as an item so we're going to have to take care of that so here are all the items that are registered or blocks as well, because that's what we have to do. So there's like all this, like dark oak stairs. Let me just scroll all the way down here for a moment. Oh yeah, here's like grindstone, fletcher table, all that kind of stuff. So well, that's not items, but whatever. That's block registry, right? No, this is miscellaneous music, miscellaneous thing, whatever. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna tell it to not return that, not return null. Tell it to return a new item stack which for some reason I can't spell which takes in item so this we're gonna put items dot lead which is what which is what I had up before now that is all you need for the tab for it to appear but if I would actually load in the game it would say item group dot dot a tutorial not that so what we're going to have to do is go into your resources open that up and create assets and then open that up again and put on the name of your mod id tut or for me it's tut and then here you can put lang which is the lang file language if i were to technically show you that with minecraft come on open Alright, so this is Minecraft, just without all those long classes. It's assets, mine, the mod ID, lang, and then en-us.json. We'll open that and we'll, well, we'll do that right now. In here, we'll put, uh, inside of the brackets, we'll put brackets, we'll say parentheses, item oh I can't spell item capital G item group dot whatever whatever you called it here which in this case is tutorial so we're gonna put item item group dot tutorial colon or whatever you want it to be called like in this case I'm just gonna say tutorial oh oh darn it I can't type tutorial I'm just going to call it mod, but you can, I'm just going to put that, and we'll launch the game. Oh, executing prepare run client, cool. 
which that should that will load the game. Yep. Uh, yeah. So we should have all this from. Oh, I did not mean to put that. All this from the other from the first video. Oh, there we go. It's actually loading. And we're just gonna full screen this. So it's actually loading. And no, oh, there we go. Let's load into our world we have created. And da, 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 reading world data. Did not know it'd take that long to load. Well, well, well. So after we load into the world, it'll be something like something like this. I would I would have I would have it set in creative. Excuse me. So it'd be easier to oh and as we see here we have the arrows. We're gonna hit the arrow to go to the other one and there you go. Did I spell it wrong? Ah Did I literally oh capital I. See what I mean? The Oh no. It is I'll tell you that. It's case sensitive. As you saw, I put an accidentally put a capital I and screw, did it load properly. So yeah, I did not know it would be that. I didn't know it'd be case sensitive, but it is. So we'll have to reload it. What? 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 Transforming mob interact. Oh, I don't really care about that. Memory keep. Eh, ignore that. All right, load. All right, open the world. I would uh, edit me opening this, but because it's a little short video today, I'm not going to. Uh, yeah, it says it's 100 percent. It's loaded. Finally. All right. So now that we've loaded in the game, but the but the yeah, the do do da. All right. So now that we're here, we'll just open our creative menu with E and just go over use these arrows to navigate around and once we get to the two edit uh, the other other one over here you see there's tutorial mod and the name we will add items I might have already said this but we'll add items as we go like blocks and all that kind of stuff oh and this is the survival and in inventory that you see like you can see I'm looking that way, yay. So that it is what will be what did I do? Oh. So that is what we'll be doing in this video, which is just creating the tab. The next video will probably be items, us creating actual items for the game. So I will see you in that video soon.